Hey y'all, what's up? Hi, hello, hi, hi. Guess what I'm back with? Another reaction video. Fall in love with me. I introduce her to the game and let her thug with me. She be like Bunny and Clyde. She even clutching me. I feel like it's you a die. She give her soul to me. She wanna be close to me. Oh, she say she fuck with me the long way. She say she gon' run my back. I had a long day. So baby, I ain't gon' lead you down the wrong way. Okay, so I know y'all like, girl, where you been? Where you been? Why you been gone so long? Where you been? We ain't had no videos. I just don't understand why y'all gotta be so ghetto. Okay. So, um, oh, shout out to my art wall back there too, by the way. Yeah, that's a thing. Um, my house actually looked decent in the background. Lily, why you gotta, oh my God, you literally acting like I don't want you in front of company. Do you have to have them brown leaves on you like that? I got to pick them off. I really do water my plant. Um, anyway, <laughs> sorry. I'm going to get into a reaction video for y'all, okay? I've been promising one of y'all, uh, one of these for y'all. One. Of the God damn, girl, it's been too long since you recorded. Can't get your words right. <sighs> it's been too long since I recorded one of these for y'all. So I'm going to go ahead and record this, okay? This is um, Karen's In the Wild, a video I found on YouTube. Well, initially I found it on Reddit, and then it led me to YouTube. Not the point, whatever. Um, now, this is going to be a little different, because normally I either watch the video first before I start reacting and recording all that. Hold on, is that some... Bitches, you growing hair on the side? Girl. Girl. Oh, boy. Because who ain't got... Yeah, Lapisha can't hold me back. Y'all can't tell me shit, boy. I done cut my hair and shit, so... Yeah, I'm a little excited because I got a little fuzz. Y'all see that fuzz? Y'all see that fuzz? Y'all see them baby hairs and shit? Damn, I just got excited looking at that. Okay, my bad. Focus. Okay, so... <laughs> So, normally I watch the video first, right? Or I'll put the videos together and make a video. But this time, I didn't really watch this one all the way through. I just kind of like, eh, take, took, took, a, took a little glance at the video, okay? So, I don't know what to expect. I don't know what to expect. But fuck it, we here, okay? We here, we gonna do it. That's all that matters. Um, I curse a lot. Okay, I curse a lot. You, you're going to hear some cussing. Okay, I'm a little loud. The video might be loud, so you might want to adjust your volume if you in there with your grandma and them because you don't want your grandma and them to know that you're listening to my cussing ass. So you might want to cut the volume down. Matter of fact, put some headphones in. Okay, anytime you see one of my videos, don't play them hoes out loud in, in public. Don't do that. Ever. <laughs> like ever because I'm always cussing always even if I'm teaching a lesson I'm cussing okay baby let me tell y'all how mad I was that I had recorded this whole video and had to go back and redo it because of the way I fucked up the audio so yes it's dark okay it's nighttime now all right a little switch up just watch the video anyway it's still funny okay so we're gonna make sure we recording Okay, because we got to be doing that. All right. Okay. Oh, shit. Damn. Is the best buy? want to be fucking you, huh? That's why you're here? You want to learn emotion? Learn how it is to fucking feel? Fucking feel? Wait a minute. I bet you Wait do. a minute. You worship the devil? Wait a minute. Huh? Yeah, you probably do. Why he got all them bags? Sir, sir. <laughs> Where are you going with these bags, though? Like, is he is he military? Like, why he got so many bags? Like, is, is he going to move in and, like, live by the washing machines and shit in Best Buy? Or I got questions. Why you got these bags? Where are you... Where you going with the with the bags in the Best Buy? Like, what's the backstory? Are they mad about the bags? You got too many bags. Okay. 
Probably do. And, and, and then what if I don't? The cops are going to show up and pretend to arrest me? <laughs> no, they're going to kick you out. And they might for real. Fuck? You ain't kicking me out? Yeah, we are. Ain't nobody scared of your fucking fat ass. Why don't you go do a fucking oh crunchy or something? Are you serious? Did you eat another fucking baby? Like You're all being recorded. I don't give a fuck. I love it. Not yeah. I don't I love it. I'm a star of the motherfucking show. Well, they see Jen, they don't speak Chinese, so she messed next to us. Karen's in the wild. This just a regular old black chick being pissed off about something that obviously really pissed her off. Like, this don't really go with the title. This is not Karen-ish. Like, this is... I think pe did the definition of Karen change while I was gone? Like, I don't think people understand what a Karen really is. Like, just because she tearing the place up doesn't make her a Karen. Like... Karens are people, well, okay, there's different versions of Karens now, because originally Karens were white women who called the cops on black people because they felt like we was doing something suspicious. Like, remember, that's how this shit all started in the first place. But then it got to the entitlement, and I gotta have this, I gotta have that, I'm this, I'm that. You know, whatever. It, it turned into a whole thing, so now it has, like, multiple meanings and shit. And don't get me wrong, Karens can also be black. But that ain't no Karen shit. That's some mad black woman shit. Like, I done told up some shit in my day. I ain't gonna, does that make me a Karen? Because I definitely went to the nail shop at one point in time, and they told me that they was too close to closing, so they couldn't do my nails. And I got mad, and I threw some shit off the counter. Like, I, I do shit like that. I, maybe not to that capacity. I don't know because the video ain't, ain't we got to keep going. But that don't really go with the title. Like, that's more so like people in the wild or people in public, wild moments in public, freakouts in public. Like, you know, some shit like that. The Karen's in the wild with this shit? No. Nah, that don't, that's false advertisement. I don't like that. this place up, ain't you? Oh, somebody pissed her off for real. Oh, she ain't with the shit. Oh, she still... Damn! What? Well, what was he laughing at? I got questions. What was he laughing at? That pissed her off to that capacity. Well, black women know they can do some damage, then. I'm surprised the cops ain't showed up yet. Baby, you got to get the hell up out of there. They they coming for you. And you and you ain't going to always, always more than one of y'all? Oh, y'all got to get the fuck. Oh, they going to jail. Oh, they going to jail. Oh, they got cameras. You ain't supposed to do that. She black too?
I'm confused. What she? I do the right thing. I live right. I don't bother anybody. I obey the laws of the land. Do your job. And she black too. Don't get personal. <laughs> <laughs> Am I missing? Oh, come on, come on. No, no, don't do that. I'm done. No. You go. This lady put up more than 20 items. Nobody's gonna sit here and count that. Oh, shit. Oh, man. Bruh. Are they serious right now? The 20 items or less, Lane? Bruh, that ain't no Karen shit. That's some nigga shit. Like, <laughs> again with this title. Yo, we do that shit all the time. Like, what the fuck? We don't sit there and count the items in the fucking basket. Like, oh. Let me see if it's 15 or 20 in here. We look at them up. All right, this is like about 20. Might, might be 25. That's cool. What the fuck it? We here. First of all, I don't like Walmart. I fucking hate Walmart. I don't like Walmart at all. Will not go to Walmart. I'll order some shit, have it delivered. I, I'm not doing Walmart. Nope. If you know me, you know I don't do Walmart. So... That's one. I could be a little biased because I don't fuck with Walmart anyway. Number two, I mean, that's a lot of groceries, though. Like, we do that shit all the time, but that's a lot of groceries. But I still don't understand why it's on the Karens in the wild video. But, okay. Definitely some nigga shit, bro. Hey, correct. No, no, leave. You gotta follow me. Go get the manager. Nobody gonna sit here and count their shit. I wanna call. <laughs> she ready to go home. Look at the little boy. She messing up Walmart. Listen. Baby, Walmart be messing up. Why would you mess up with I'm, yeah, You guys making money off me. Let me take my shit and leave. She's in the room. I do it. She let me do it. Who gonna, who gonna sit there and read every... I, that, that's crazy. Nobody gonna do that. People's in a rush to go. Don't do that, Bro, man. people do not want to listen. Nobody wants to count that shit. But she knew damn well she had more than 20 items you in that bag. Oh, 20, I, no, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to go. I just got off of work. I'm tired. I want to go home. To my family. <laughs> she sound like the black like ass mama. <laughs> the fact that she's so calm, items, like, it's the calmness for me. Like, she really legit thinks she right. Like, <laughs> she really don't give a fuck. That is ridiculous. <laughs> she mad at Walmart because they make that people count the items. Like... When I see you want to fight with the customers. Did she have clothes? Am I tripping? Was them clothes? That's bad as hell. Do your job and let us leave. I don't have time for this. She got clothes too. Ah, I was just I fool. Hold on, a stroke. Ma'am. Ma'am. Workers, 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 workers. <laughs> Bro, she done pulled out all these little items she wrote for that shit. We do some nigga shit. Damn, black people gonna black No, I'm not gonna sit here and count. Oh my god, I got one. No, I'm not gonna do that. She got all the same. I'm tired. I'm not gonna hold up the customers doing that. Bro, you hold up the customers with all that shit that bad. They make them damn conveyor bills this big. You know what? You address every customer like that. I mean, we do it, but damn, we don't do it to my. I ain't need it that bad. That's bad. She got a whole basket of shit. She got hey, hey, hey. What the hell? Is it? Is them bananas? Was it the potato sacks? What? Oh my god, what's happening? What? Wait, was it my bag of potatoes? Okay, yeah, hold on. They must be in another country because in my where I'm from, they call that a basket. Did she say trolley? Did he say trolley? That's for sure a basket. Yeah, they ain't from here because that's a basket with a whole bunch of fucking toilet paper. 
why? Is is it a recession? Because I mean, I know we in we damn damn near in one now, and all bullshit aside, that shit about to start happening for real. But um, I'm still stuck on the trolley part. I don't know. Fuck it. We continue. Hey, Jim. Hey, Jim. Call the place. I'm calling the place. Oh, it's a competition. Y'all could have let her have one of them. Come on, y'all ain't have to do that. That's just selfish. Come on. Don't do that. I'm going to ask this y'all white. I think that's the AR. I ain't got my glasses on. That look like an AR-15. To tell somebody to not block you in and, and they got a kid? What? I mean, damn, a lady fucking fired me up. I went to a funeral earlier and the lady got mad at me because I apparently parked in front of her driveway, but I'm in the hood. So it was like a gated fence that was like half broke down and had chains and shit on it. I didn't think it was a fucking driveway. I honestly thought the house was abandoned. No bullshit. Until her fucking husky came out and barking and shit. And then she came out the house and told me I was blocking her driveway. Because that was the second time I parked there. So the first time I parked there, I guess she tried to leave and I was in the funeral. So she was saying she didn't want to get my car towed because I was at the funeral. And she was mad. She was going off on me. She was a black chick. a black lady. We in the hood. I understand. But me, I respect my, my older black people. I'm sorry, ma'am. I didn't realize this was a driveway. I honestly didn't realize it was somebody living in that house. It looked abandoned. I didn't know. All right? I'm going to move. But I ain't going to come out guns blazing. And she ain't going to come out guns blazing, I hope. Like, is this what we doing now? We pulling out ARs to get motherfuckers out of our spots? Like, you that mad? You can't be, you can't be that mad. You can't be that mad. <laughs> you can't be that mad, bro. Only uh, you approached that guy with a firearm. To basically yeah. say, can you pull your truck up a little ways and threaten him and his child oh, out in public child. with no expectation of privacy. So as far as your, um, you can't record me, I'll sue you, you can get fucked. But don't worry, I don't need you all to tell me who that guy is. This article already did a fantastic job of laying it out. His name is David H. Berry, owner of Fat Finger Construction. Fat. And as this article lays out, in his past he's been charged with at least three felonies, including battery and burglary. Three felonies? According to Pinellas County court records, all were pled down to misdemeanors. Are you hey, fucking he threatened... kidding shits me? What? Three fucking felony? Three? Three? Tres? Uno, dos, tres felonies? <laughs> Boy, Natalie said it best. He got the complexion for the protection because cause it ain't no way that could have been a nigga. You play down three felonies to misdemeanors? Battery on top of that? Nigga, is you serious right now? It's black people doing jail, like jail, jail time, like 25 to life over motherfucking drugs. Bullshit ass charges. It's motherfuckers going to jail for goddamn a barely a pound of marijuana. You goddamn got a gram in your car and they be trying to arrest you. Shit, man, are you for... You should if sir... Had you had the felonies on record, you wasn't even supposed to have a gun. Like it's so, it's so, it's so much wrong with this situation. It's so much wrong with this situation. I'm trying not to get into it. I'm trying not to get into it. And another thing, that whole you can't record me without my permission, blah blah blah. That's illegal. Let me tell y'all something. I'm, I'm gonna hip you up to a little game. It's not illegal. Stop saying that. Okay, you're not supposed to do it. But it's not illegal. 
because I literally just had an HR situation at my job because I was recording everything that was going on in my job for reasons that will later be discussed. But I was definitely recording things and I told the HR, like, I'm recording because my ass going to be covered because I don't trust nobody, especially y'all. And when I say y'all, y'all know who I mean. So, yeah, I record it because I never know what anybody's capable of. I recorded my meetings with HR. And if it was illegal, I'd have lost my job on the spot. So it's not illegal. It's just, it's frowned upon. Okay? You are supposed to tell. And then, really, all I had to do was say, hey, I'm recording you. So if you see somebody recording you, they just told you. They go your permission. Or really, not even your permission. There's, I'm telling you. I don't need you to say, yes, you can record me. I'm just going to record you. You see me recording you. Therefore, you know I'm recording you. I've just made you aware of it. It's not illegal. Stop saying that shit. It's freedom of fucking press speech. We can do what the fuck we want to do. And if it was illegal, we wouldn't even give a damn anyway. We'd still be fucking recording. <laughs> fuck does that matter? Why do people always want to pull out the law on some shit? Nigga. We still going to record you, bro. Like, you still going to go on the internet. You still probably going to go viral. Ain't shit going to change. Ain't nothing going to happen. So shut the fuck up. It's annoying. Damn. Ah. Jeremy, uh, he didn't take this lightly, and he called police. And how did police respond to this situation? Yeah, as, as you know, the fine, fine Clearwater finest, they don't see a problem with this. Yeah, they Are said they there was around? nothing they could do. You know that was a black dude. I can hear his voice. Let it go. Like hung out across the street. Is that the best you can do, Clearwater, Florida? I mean, look, I get that David is a wannabe cop with his AR-15 and his fake cop truck back there that he was worried about being blocked in by a trailer. Um, but he's not. Is it just that he owns a business in your city? No, 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 we're not gonna just let that fly by. We're not, we're not gonna just let that fly by. Mm -mm. Okay, let's go back. It ain't because he own a business in the city. It ain't because he an entrepreneur. Okay, it, it ain't, it ain't that. If that's the, if that's the case, then let let me know. Cause if it's the entrepreneurial thing. And that's the benefit we get, shit. Let me know. And I'm going to start carrying it heavy, out loud, out in the public. Just I'm going to just start walking around with my shit. If that's an entrepreneur benefit, no, that's a white person's benefit. And while I respect a uh, brother here, uh, whatever the white dude name was, I don't know. Don't give a fuck. I, I get it. You're trying to point out some racist shit, Karen shit, Ken shit, whatever, some fucked up shit within the justice system, with the cops not doing shit, with this nigga having felonies to misdemeanors. I understand that. But what you failed to make the point of is that he got away with that because he white. Just like you white. So had you did it, you'd get away with it too. Whether you worked at fucking Walmart or you was an entrepreneur. Your fucking occupation don't matter, bruh. It's that skin color. Hmm? It's that lack of melanin. It's that lack of melanin. That's why the fuck he got away with it. Not because he owns a business in the city. No, that ain't it. That ain't it. I'm going to need you to get a little more educated for you. You shouldn't have said that. You see, you was doing good until you said that shit. You should have said because he was white. But because you white, I understand. Y'all got to stick together and shit. You fucked up. You, it was going well and you just ruined it. It's because he had the complexion for the protection. Like I said. Check out my man's right here. Look at him. Y'all see this right here? Y'all see this right here? This a threat. Hmm? 
that's a threat to society. That right, that little thing right there. Look at his goddamn stance. Look at his stance, y'all. That's that shit. That's a sign, okay? Clearly his parents racist, and I'm assuming that that's his daddy that's back there. So clearly his motherfucking parents are racist. Clearly. Now you got him. This is how racism continues. That's the side. Look at my man's stance right here. Look at it. Huh? He got the... Anybody that stand like that, that mean they ready for war. That mean they don't like you. Look at his face. That's hate. He got hate in his eyes for a black man. He's pissed. Let, let that have been another white dude. Ain't no way he'd be looking like that. First of all, this whole thing wouldn't have happened if that was another white dude. But ain't no way. He looked like he ready for war. And his parents made him that way. And since his parents are acting like that, specifically his mama, in front of him, he gonna grow up thinking that shit okay. So then he gonna start doing it. And then you got motherfuckers like Dylan Roof. That's that generational shit. That nigga a threat. I don't give a fuck what you gotta say about it. My man is a threat. Look at him. Look at that face. Look at that posture, that stand. Okay? Yeah, he a threat for sure. Y'all better, <laughs> better watch out. Stay woke, like they say. Stay motherfucking woke. been my uncle i'm telling y'all right now sis wouldn't have made it to wherever she got to get going because i would have found her and just beat the shit out of her motherfucking ass because you're not gonna slap my uncle in the face because he a black officer and he'll try to pull some hero shit like this and then i'm gonna have to fight you because because it ain't no way not if i see it not if i see it i need that address but let me did, did she make like ah! that? <laughs> your hands on me you not finna slap me as a black man or an officer <laughs> I bet she wasn't expecting to get hit the fuck back <laughs> boy I love us but we is not with the shit dog we are not with the shit I love every moment of it I do <laughs> Oh, I seen this one before. I think that's a good one. Who's she bad building? Who's she kidding? Why she like her name, Kathy? She like her name, She's giving very much. Someone's a little wrong over their order. Apparently that's all for them. What's wrong with her? Oh, she won't look. She's not really funny. Baby, you don't need nothing. None of that. You don't need none of that. You don't need none of that. What you don't need? No, I know. It's not. All that soda you drinking. Someone's a little wrong over their order. Apparently that's all for them. Ew. Uh, I hope that was her food. Gross. Oh my God. That's nasty as hell. 
compilation i don't understand the title i don't um it was kind of fun watching some shit that i didn't see prior to like that it kind of caught me off guard a little bit i might have to keep doing that i just i don't like it because you never know what you're gonna get it might be something boring that i don't want to react to but i might have to start doing that more often and i would appreciate y'all if y'all could just you know find some videos and put them together for me into a big video i really like just something slight you know a little three five minute video nothing serious and send it to your girl basically to keep me from doing all the leg work that's what that is i'm lazy as hell and that's what be taking me so long to get youtube videos out because life be life it but nevertheless i'm gonna give y'all some more okay so if you see me in the same shirt and the same scenery of whatever is going on here then that's what that is i'm gonna try to get out one more reaction video get one done um, because I work been hella busy and I got some cool. I got some tea coming up for y'all But y'all gonna have to wait on it. All right, and make sure you like comment and subscribe Damn, I be forgetting about that part Trippin'. See y'all in the next video. Bye